Hi guys, so today I'm here with my friends Noah and Corey. They also live with me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And just to, to clarify, where are you from again? Uh, Scotland. And you're from? Scotland! Good, you get the representation. We love it up on this channel. Today's video, by the way, is sponsored by NordVPN, so there'll be a little sketch in the middle. But, speaking of ads... We're, today's video is about ads. So, uh, after I did a video with Jay Foreman a couple months ago, everyone was talking about their favorite British ads. I never heard of any of them, so I thought, it'd be a fun idea for these two to show me their favorite ads. We can bond over things that I missed as a child. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> He's definitely thinking about my dad. <laughs> oh! I thought this was a, like a joke where it's just like, haha. You were the only one that makes bad jokes. <laughs> oh no, I definitely like. <laughs> Every time you talk about your childhood, I'm assuming you're talking about that. <laughs> That's not going in. Anyway. That's what he said too. Oh my God. Wow! Let's jump into the ads! One of my favorite adverts was the baby bell advert. I know what a baby bell is. It is this nice little ring cheese thing. Ring? It's a ring. ring. It's a little it's circle. It's not a donut. It's not got a hole in it. It's like a tiny little bit of, like, pee down. It's a circle. It's like a baby wheel. Yeah. yeah. Do you know how the tune goes? Baby bell. <laughs> no, no. I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember how it goes. I was thinking of it. Ba, 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 baby, ba. Oh, yeah. It's about cheese. It's a baby, ba, 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 ba. Pretty much every baby belt advert, because it's shaped like a wheel, someone drops a baby belt and it just rolls and then it goes ba, ba, ba. Got it. Got I got it. a lot of mileage out of that. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm excited to, to see if this is one of your favorites. A 1992. Yeah, I don't know. So it came out before you were born. 2003. I was four. Oh, 2003. Oh, that's... There's a lot of pixels in this ad. They're all gonna be like that. I feel like we have a very similar ad for something in the US, but I don't know where it is. Mate, that's like 80p in the meal deal as well. Like, just let it go. Oh, that kid just stole one that was in the air. Oh, what? Baby bell. Why would you have a baby bell in your pocket yet eat one that fell from the sky? Culture? <laughs> Jeez, culture. <laughs> Good. Can you beat that? Do you know what? I'm gonna start off really strong. Mm -hmm. There's oh. there's a whole story behind this one. Oh, frosted flakes. They're gonna taste great. They're gonna taste great. I can hear the sound of frosties that give me blades. They're gonna taste great. Oh, okay. Even leggies to wait? Ladies who wait. That's oddly specific. Someone knows how to rhyme. <laughs> what rhymes with late and great? Wow. So in school, everyone said that this kid put two pencils up his nose and hit his head off the desk. Oh! <laughs> but then survived? Which isn't true at all. But it's a good ad. Is that just a weird Scottish thing? No. This I've, is a... This I, yeah, I know, but I've, ne I've seen it. I've never heard of that. If Not you can imagine it, by the way, our Frosties, Frosted Flakes ads were mostly baseball oriented. Why? Why? Because it was American. Yeah, but, but what does that have to do with cold? Because baseball, America's pastime. Cereal, America's fast time to eat. Bar. American cereals are weird though. You know what Lely Kelly is? I don't know what a Lely yes, Kelly is. Lely Kelly shoes They're are... the cutest shoes. They're the cutest shoes. Oh yeah. <laughs> Lely Kelly. The marketing so they're like, so cool. You mean the cutest shoes? <laughs> Pretty much. They're like girls school shoes and they're like, you know... Are like, they gel? Yeah. Kind of. Like, they, like they're like gel shoes they and you open, you open up the heel and there's a little like toy in it, little doll in it. In your shoe? Yeah, so you you uh, get out, see. you get your foot out of the playground and just Did you not have that? You d there was this whole Why thing. Why would I have a shoe? There, 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 there was this whole thing in like the early noughties where shoes either lit up or had toys in them. Yes. Yeah. No, no, the toy thing I've never heard of him. You never heard of having toys in your shoes? No. I've, I've only seen that for Lely Kelly's. <laughs> Imagine kids selling like, you know, Lely Kelly stuff <laughs> at kids school. Kids putting their lunch money in there so they couldn't get it taken off of them. Oh, that's so sad! <laughs> okay, this is nine years ago. I love Lily. I need to keep the cut. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look how they're holding the phone. <laughs> it's been really badly dubbed over. In the shoe? Yeah. Oh yeah. Yes. Cool, though, yeah. <laughs> this is adorable, I have to admit. 
Put it this way, they've been on that set like all day trying to get this one ad done. Yeah. There, there's some with like makeup phones and some with like dolls. I did. I forgot that there were makeup ones, mm. but there, there's dolls as well. This is one of those ads. I want that my I really... shoes to just walk, you know. No. No, but the noughties were the prime time for shoes having things in that they didn't need, like Heelys. Oh, those Heelys were fun. are very. They're still cool. Yeah. They don't make them in our size. I was told. That's my cool. mom told me they're illegal, so I wouldn't get any. Uh, this one's a Scottish ad that I didn't think I'd learn about a product that doesn't exist in America. We have literally everything. Okay, so this I is for Iron. This. this is for so Iron Brew. Um, we just make stuff that isn't needed, like toys and shoes. This is this is a High School Musical Iron Brew ad that is for real. Yeah, like actually. This high school sing song. Wait, was that? Not what's the name of this high school? Uh, so it's Ock and Duke. Ock and Duke. Ock and Duke. That sounds like that something really? Ryu says in like um, Street so Fighter. Is... Oh. There's no cheerleaders. For basketball teams But we've got something That's good for morale It's crazy, it's ginger It's phenomenal We've got no one oh. Called Jabra or No, they went for it We don't have hair cuts That look like two peas Excuses, class and girls Are rational It's crazy, it's ginger We're oh, shaking it Break it down Break it down Break it down we got no time for American hope. Peter. 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 Wait, what? Wait, what? Why did he say Peter? He said beat it. Beat it. He said beat it. I like the guy at the end. Yeah. I guess that's why it's popular. In, yeah. In Scotland. It's the only place in the world, one of the only places in the world where Coke isn't the most popular drink. I think that was actually quite lovely. It's really good. It Iron Brew have got too good much. Adverts. They put a lot of effort into this. So I've seen this. the Christmas one. The Christmas one. I was gonna I was gonna bring that, but I decided against it. This is called Moon Sand. It's kinetic sand. It's I think now... I know what it is. If, if it's the stuff that you hold and it's together, and then when you let your hand like this, it just drips. It's moon yeah. sand. Moon sand. The sand, sand that, that molds, molds like dough. Moons. <laughs> moons. <laughs> just... Why is the video not loading? Uh, Has this ever happened to you? You're trying to load an oddly specific video on YouTube, but it turns out it's not available in your region? Well, if it hasn't, where do you live? I want to move there. Actually, I don't have to, because I use NordVPN, today's video sponsor. NordVPN. I've been using NordVPN for about four months now, so when they reached out to sponsor my channel, I was like, hell yeah. Why do I use NordVPN? It's really fast. Whenever I get told a video is blocked in my region, I immediately try out my VPN. But if you've ever tried using a free VPN, you just know they don't work. By the time you get it to load, it doesn't have the ability to load video, not even at 720p. It's horrible. And your data is not actually private if you're using a free one. And that's just one of the good reasons why you should be using NordVPN. Protect yourself. But with NordVPN on, I'm watching my German Netflix in full HD, and it just works. As arbeitet nur. And even better yet, if you go to nordvpn.com slash Evan or use code Evan at checkout, you get 75% off the three-year plan. That's a steal, which is what the hackers are trying to do to your data right now if you're not using a VPN. So sign up right now, nordvpn.com slash Evan. It's easy to remember. Evan. That's to me. And with that, thank you to the video sponsor. Let's get back to the ads. Got the Nord working. Let, let's get going. <laughs> Woo! Moons like dough. That's what Moonsand's all about. Moon sand is the multiple sand that never dries this out. This is so America. You can squish it, you can squash it, you can mold it, you can stack it. Make a moon sand castle. Moonsand even floats. 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 It's but also, like I dough. feel like we def- I don't know, I don't remember that commercial, but I knew we had- It has to be. No. <laughs> like, crusher. Yeah, Crusher. This one's brilliant. They make some, like, horror dream Weird. ads, yeah. don't they? This this was like it's so weird meta ship hosting before it was popular. This is like a YouTube poop. It's 2003. Yeah. It, this was like a Quiznos ad. This is, it's like stuck in the recesses of my memory. I forgot this existed until I. Like, <laughs> who got paid to make this ad? Is what I wanted. <laughs> They've changed it so much now. You know, it's not it's not vegetarian. They put like beef in that. <sighs> Good. Delicious. <laughs> It's More <laughs> beef in my milk. <laughs> I want to put the other parts of the cow in the other parts of the cow. I just can't imagine being the guy in the meeting to be like, here's our finished ad for you. And Crush is just like, 
Oh. Yeah. It's weird though, because in, in 2003, that's when people, again, discovered CGI, and so they've just got like people's this heads is... turning into like fruits and stuff, but this, this is, is Avengers, just... basically. And you like this, this is a good ad. I, l I mean, yes. I've forgotten about it <laughs> until I found it again today. I want some Crusher. Crusher. This is something that you'd find on like Albino Black Sheep. <laughs> Have you seen the Cadbury's eyebrows advert? No, oh. I've never heard of this. Is it like this? Chocolate eyebrows. Did, did someone not go on like Britain's Got Talent to do something like yeah, this? Yeah, it's dreadful. What? Yeah. Oh, don't tell me they sang a song from a chocolate ad. No. Okay. No, it's weirder. It's... Oh. <laughs> Are they really doing that? No. No. I feel like I'm being subliminally advertised to. Find happiness in everything and share the joy. This is a point where Cadbury's, this was just after Cadbury's had like this gorilla ad, where they had this gorilla on drums. Yeah. <laughs> How is this an ad for chocolate? <laughs> How? Is it, gonna, is it gonna even talk like, about chocolate? Okay, no. that's it. A glass and a half full of joy. Yes, yeah, a glass and a half. Of milk. Of, of milk. a gorilla. Of milk, because Cadbury's milk chocolate. It's got milk. Oh, because it's healthy. So you know what Fruit by the Foot is? Of course. And that's the same as Fruit Winders here. So what I'm going to show you is an ad essentially for Fruit by the Foot. I'm excited to see yeah. the difference. Fruit by the Foot is like a roll, and you unroll it, and it's like three feet long of And it's got little comic strips on Fruit, fruit. Winders. Yeah. Oh, you have comic strips. Yeah, they're really cute. Um, the I like ones. how a majority of your ads are for food, whereas when I do this video for the American stuff, it's just <laughs> insurance ads and mattress ads. It's because- Well, there's some, I've got some of them. Yeah, I mean, oh, okay. in, there was like this whole period of insurance ads being massive. <laughs> this looks American. Okay. Oh. Doubles for the first Delicious. Time, two fruity flavors side by side. So, double the flavors. Double the fun. <laughs> yeah, double yeah. the flavors, double the fun. So, how this how this works is essentially all of these ads, there's like hundreds of them. There's the sexy lady fruits, and what they do is they I'm kill sorry. the sexy lady fruits. Okay, from that, sure. Yeah, because they're sexy ladies. Melons, and then they kill yeah. the yeah, well then they kill the other fruits and make them into fruit winders and like dance with them and stuff. Washing machines look longer it. with Calgon. Without your washing machine. I came down and there it was. Oh, Broken. she looks sad. Water oh. everywhere. Water? In no time, the laundry piled up. An engineer said it was caused by lime scale damage. <laughs> lime scale? <laughs> to help prevent the lime scale buildup, it dissolves a lot this faster. Is, my engineer is sponsored. I'm not. Unique Express Ball technology makes it the fastest dissolving tablet you can find. Mr. Sparkle. This helps keep your washing machine working at its best. Now Calgon goes in every wash. <laughs> That wasn't that great. Washing machines live it's, longer it's, with Calvin. It's not the advert that I remember, it's just the, the, the song. little song. That's there. so specific as well, like, washing machines live... Who Everyone knows? knows that though. That's so strange. Like, you would say Calgon and people would just sing it. Do you know what Daz is? It is a type oh. of soap for washing machines. Yeah, exactly. So, they had this entire run of adverts that was like a soap. What Daz? Oh, wait, you mean a soap opera? Yeah, like a soap opera. Oh, I just got it. <sighs> yeah. Oh, it's good. Next up is a date with this handsome devil. Go start me off for a hundred. How about if we lose the shirt? Yeah! Yeah! Oh. Oh, nice spot. Shame about that grubby vest. Ten quid? Nah, five up. Oh, man. You should have used Daz. Tidy whiteies. <laughs> Daz? Yeah, Daz. Daz? Get <laughs> whiteness or your money back. A hundred quid for you! A hundred and fifty! <laughs> Does <laughs> like, I'm gonna get some action tonight. Thanks, Daz. Wow. So they would He'd they would do this thing where it was on, like, yeah. what happens next time on Cleaner Clothes? And it wasn't a show, so I never got to see it. It really stressed oh, me out. Oh, that's depressing. Yeah. The fact that you just said you'd want to see him with his shirt off. And... <laughs> We're just skimming over it. <laughs> just no, like just no one said anything. No, I like to put jokes in for the audience only. <laughs> Not for the audience. This How is you like you laugh along when you edit. <laughs> this is called Dormio Advert Italian representation. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I <laughs> They use the same puppets. Stand back. Oh. Stand back. It's a ready. It's a ready. This is Ellie Spaghetti's <laughs> family. This <laughs> homemade lasagna made with dolmio. Why is there no wife? Where's the mother? You can't be She's old. Homemade, eh? No, because that's the mum and dad. Then... Oh. Why do they have a single parent family? 
Oh, oh when's your Domeo Day? Office. When's your Domeo Day? I don't like Domeo Thursday. Domeos. Really? Oh. I just had some yesterday, actually. I'm just kidding. I used Tesco Spy. I've seen some of their ads in the, at the cinema, mm -hmm. but I have no clue because I feel like it's the storyline. That was this one they have kids or something. Yeah. So it totally spun out. It just began this one guy. I say one guy. This one meerkat was like classic. You're you're confusing me with comparethemarket.com. This is compare the meerkat. So it's basically Geico the gecko. No, he's I'm a gecko, not Geico. Oh, that's the whole concept behind behind. Yeah, Geico but could you actually go online and compare meerkats with Geico? No, you no. couldn't. You can actually compare meerkats. Cheap car insurance, meerkats, two very different things. Listen there, Jingle. Compare the market, not come. Listen mine. Compare the meerkats. Don't even sound the same! Compare the meerkat.com, <laughs> compare the market.com. Simples. <laughs> oh, you can do the noise? Hey, that was him, probably. Do it. <laughs> no, that's terrible. Yeah. Oh, okay. I, I didn't hear the noise because I heard Noah's so I assume that was it. Now that I'm looking back, we would go into school and try and do this. Yeah. Like, this is, it's really weird that ads for adults affect That's you. so weird because that's such a long tail marketing campaign for them. Yeah. Because I used to I used to recite like adverts to my school friends and everyone would laugh and think it was so funny. I don't know they were laughing at me. That's a bit depressing. Yeah, no, I know. You don't have to be posh to be privileged. It's like a no claims advert. Oh and I used my god, to recite yeah. that word by word. A no claims as in I didn't know what that was. I oh, was just yeah. like, you don't have to be posh to I be had, privileged. I didn't like it was all these lawyers and stuff for like yeah. if you'd been if someone had hit an accident, it's not your fault. I yeah. had no idea what that was until now. Kids watch a lot of ads that are yeah. not made for them. Well no, they are made for them. Advertised to the kids, they get they get stuck in their heads and they don't shut up about it to their parents. It's brand recognition. Huh. Compare the meerkat. That's horrible. There you go. Everyone has to pay oh, this animation is so bad. Premiums. But Hastings Direct is wrestling it back. We'll cover the cost of your tax if you buy direct from us before September. This is September like Shrek 30th. animation. Yeah. But it was seven years after Shrek. Come on, let us help you tighten your He's belt. He's oddly buff. Tax the tax with Hastings Direct. Call 0800 double 1066. <laughs> Okay. See, that proves Kids. that it doesn't work. Because I didn't know what the advert was for. Yeah, but you call the, you call the number. You know what the number is. Be like, I need insurance for I need my daddy. Yeah. I think it's car insurance, right? I, I don't, don't know what I don't it know. is. Exactly. I just, I just it doesn't If anything... I've it, used it for travel insurance, I think, maybe. I'm good for, I'm good for if I want to know when the Battle of Hastings was. 1066. 1066. Good for the citizenship. This test. is the Ready Breck advert, and it's cereal that I didn't like, but I wanted to like because of the advert. That's it's, they good marketing. It you're eating really it because you're like, I don't even like it, but yeah. it's a good dad. My brother had it every morning and I was really jealous that he liked it because I didn't it was, like it's it. It's like porridge. Oh. It's you, oats, it's, yeah. It's but like, full of sugar. I mean, we had a lot of cool oatmeal commercials with like cookies and stuff. <laughs> they got the pentatonics on this. <laughs> What are they putting in that oatmeal? Be ready for anything with Reggie Brick. <laughs> that was a really good ad. I mean... I liked it. Well, it was when I was like eight and I was I, like... Yeah, I, was, I mean, I liked it. I just think... You don't have to be sarcastic. No, it was because you started yawning at the end. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> King of the Road. I hope it's not a song that is copyrighted. I mean, it's a parody of it. Oh. What is this an advert for? Road safety. Yeah. You, an advert to stay safe? Yeah. yeah. You gotta stop. Look. Listen. Live. Is this paid for by the British government? Yeah, I think so. Probably. Uh, no, it's... That was a bunch of... Think. I don't know if Think is owned by the government or not. I mean, it clearly works. But they had a whole bunch of these little hedgehog ads to the point it's ingrained to me, with me, that when I th have to cross the road, I think of hedgehogs. Yeah, Sea track Think Train. There's a railway... Oh, that! Yeah. Ice fly with my little eye, something beginning with T. Is it a tractor? <laughs> no. Tree. No. Is it a train? It has to be a tree. We've had that. Do you give up? Yes, I do. Oh no. Is it track? <laughs> oh, I thought I'd see it. See track, think train. <laughs> what else would you think? That though? spooked me out. See so track, much when I was think train. Oh duh. Yeah. See wheel, really think good. car. Oh no. 
See road, think car. <laughs> that just seems like an obvious thing. I mean, it worked. You were scared. I mean, clearly people were being hit by trains. I guess. And also where I grew up, we don't really have train tracks. So Really? No, we have highways. But my mom would teach me, like, if you see the road, you turn back around right away because you will die. Those drivers do not care. They're not from New Jersey. They're from New York. They'd be driving to the shore and they'd be, like, passing by trying to hit wow. kids. We never trying to hit that. kids. Well, no, my mom would just be like, oh, yeah, the, you know, Pennsylvania to New York drivers will try and hit you because they're bad drivers. And they see a kid, they're like, you know. Americans are weird, man. Listen. You have a train safety advert. Let's calm down. Uh, you haven't seen my video. video. You have gun like drill like lessons in school. It'd be good if you had them. You'd be safer. No, it wouldn't. From, be AR from what? <laughs> and our final ad is one that I've heard a lot about, and no one wants to show me. This is this. I, I just ads. want to see the go compare ad. This ruined adverts forever. Right. It's fine the first time you watch it. You're like, oh, that's this is cool. my first time. Take my go compare no. virginity. Okay. <laughs> what go compare did was the same song every single time. And it was the same, the same idea was that someone would be talking about something about comparing the market or something like that. And the Go Compare man would show up and start singing. Singing. That sounds, it's like High School Musical. The Coffee work. Cup, what a great company. Oh, sure, eh? <laughs> what can you do? What can you do? Go Compare, Go Compare, Go be sure when you insure first Go Compare. Where your choice is a many, you could save a pretty penny when you go online to Go Compare. Oh, fair boys, you know. Check them out, go compare. With just a few clicks, save your phone do licks. And you thank your stars that you went to go compare. How much do you reckon they're paying him? He's only a tenor. Why are they shaking? Oh, because he's singing. That you went to go compare. That was funny. Okay. He's only a tenor. That was a That's beautiful good. pun. But now imagine this for like eight years. Every day. Try and watch The Simpsons yeah. and then this. Well, I guess oh we should God, go compare mean. this. To the video I'm making in two weeks where we're doing American ads and you guys have to watch those. <laughs> anyway, I uh, hope you've enjoyed this video reliving some uh, British nostalgia. If you want to see a video in which these two react to some American ads, I'll be making that in a couple weeks, so subscribe and you'll see that on a Sunday coming up soon. Ring the bell, do all the fun things. Also, check these guys out. Links in the description. Also, thanks, by the way, to our sponsors, NordVPN.com slash Evan again. Uh, thank you very much for sponsoring the video, helping this happen. I'll see you guys next Sunday. Goodbye. Bye.